How are you? Good. I am in the mood, sister. Peanut butter freezer pie. It's summer in Texas. We've made this a million times. And it's freaking delicious in Texas, you know? I mean, it's 358 degrees. All right, I'm All right, set. Sandy. You wanna make the crust first? Cause yes. that'll go. So we're gonna take about 30 vanilla wafers because nothing goes better with peanut butter and bananas and vanilla wafers. Ah, it's so true. Right now we're making our vanilla wafer crust. Um, we have done several different cookies before, but I think that vanilla wafers taste best with peanut butter. But you know, you, we could use any cookie at the bottom of this, which I think is great. We just put in three tablespoons of butter. And with the brown sugar and the vanilla wafers, mixing that up and just patting it along the bottom. And honestly, you can bake this for 10 minutes, but you don't even need to. It can be a perfect no-bake crust. All right, Sandy, now that I got this crust done, why don't you start on the filling? That is so pretty, and it deserves something amazing to top it. <laughs> so if you'll cut bananas, because oh, we're going to do bananas. like a layer of bananas, I'll start the inside. Here's the thing, the casserole queens never poo-poo somebody who buys a, uh, like a convenience product. People are busy. People have lives, they have kids, they have things they got to go to. Buy a, a bottle of the chocolate sauce, awesome. We are gonna start with a half cup of peanut butter, half a stick of cream cheese. I'm gonna add vanilla extract. The brown sugar goes in, and just take a little bit of the cream and add it in. That is mixing up beautifully. For those of y'all that don't know us, we're out of Austin, Texas, and it's hot here. I don't know if y'all know that. And so we like a good freezer pie and that won't heat up the entire uh, kitchen. And then while she's putting that on there, I will clean the dishes. The beauty about this is that we are also making a spiked milkshake. So how about we get our drink on? <laughs> what do you do think? It. Let's tidy up and start cooking. Two glasses. Check. Straw dispenser, my favorite. Check. What are we going to fill that with? How about some liquor? <laughs> I like that. And some ice cream. I like that a lot. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Freezer day continues. I'm going to grab some booze. We're making spiked milkshakes, y'all, because we can. And that's the beauty of it. So we're, we got, we're of age. We're of age, <laughs> but just by a slight hair. <laughs> Coffee liqueur in there. Now we're gonna add dark rum, six ounces of that. And then we also need um, some malt powder, about six tablespoons. You want me to get you some ice cream? Yes, that would be fantastical. All right, I'm gonna blend. <laughs> you can't stop me. <laughs> uh. And then we're just gonna garnish it with these lovely crushed coffee beans and we're gonna shave some delicious dark chocolate. Oh. Ah, you do good work, Crystal Cook. Thank you. You do good, good work. Cheers. Cheers, love. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. On all the booze. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> mm. Now, I do love the coffee. Yeah, but I think there could be some other wonderful flavor combinations. Like maybe do a vanilla. Yep. And with maybe some Bailey's yes. Irish cream, some mint along with that, mm. little garnish. That would be awesome. It would be good. You, come on, let's go to the pool. I believe I have a uh, sunny day calling my name. I think I... Shall you come with me, love? Hear it too. Let us go. Ah, <laughs> uh, nothing like this for a, a hot day. This mm. is so delicious. Mmm. Delightful. Cheers, baby. Cheers. We're gonna have to slow down on these. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I was thinking about that freezer pie. I think there's some, some things that we could do to it also if we ever wanted to change it up. I'm getting a little bit of a buzz, I have to admit. And my milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. <laughs> <laughs> yep. 
And you know, this milkshake was so easy, but so was that freezer pie. They could mix it up with some graham crackers or oh, some that'd be nice. ginger snaps, something like that. That's or a chocolate hazelnut spread would yep. be awesome. Be really good. Just change Instead out the peanut, peanut butter. butter. Oh. Cause that <gasps> still goes well with bananas. The casserole queens are so smart. <laughs> I love that. Let's go make it immediately. We'll have that for dessert after our dessert. Yeah. <laughs> mm, beautiful. I love you. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Subscribe to Hungry and feed your food obsession.